Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh Hello. 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 Oh, ain't you common? They're very common, aren't they? I can smell council coming from somewhere. I don't know where it is. Sister, look, what? they're wearing their finest Primark. <laughs> Oxfam was busy, look at him. Oh, dear me. Here, sister. What? Have you put on weight? Well, what do you mean? Do you think this dress makes me look fat? No, dear. It's your belly and your bum that make you look fat. <laughs> you excuse me, I have got the body of an 18-year-old. Well, give it a back, because you're stretching it. <laughs> oh, shut your face, you ugly old trout. <laughs> Ugly. Ugly! <laughs> I've got the face of a film star. Yeah, Shrek. <laughs> <laughs> I've been shopping as well. Have you bought anything? Yes, I've bought myself some new perfume. Popped into Fenwick's. It's lovely. All right. Here, smell this. Well, let's have a Oh, that's lovely, that. What's that called? That is an evening in Paris. Oh, yeah. Oh. Have a whiff of this. Oh. <laughs> That's disgusting! What's that? <laughs> That's a fortnight in Benidorm. <laughs> well, sister, we've got to stop messing around. We're here to work. Are we? Yes, dear. All right, we're going to sing, aren't we? We are going to sing. Would you like to hear a song? Yeah! Leslie Garrett will be very jealous after this number, won't she? She will. Right, where's that sound? Money, money, money. It must be funny when you're a rich man's girl. This is actually my third year to be performing in Canterbury and I must say that I walk past the Louis Theatre and I haven't been inside yet right. but I can't wait to see it because it just looks incredible. Yeah. Also Cinderella is the best pantomime story without fail. Uh, the part of Buttons is lovely because you get a lot of pathos with Cinderella. Obviously he loves Cinderella so much but she only wants him as a best friend so you get the R's and it's just I'm really looking forward to it. John is incredible as a singer a dancer um, and it's just got everything you've got the baddies with the ugly sisters in a mic and it's, yeah it's just good and of course I get to perform with Dave Lee again <laughs> whether I'm right whether I'm wrong whether I find a place in this world or I never belong I gotta be me I just gotta be me the dream that I see So, John, you're here in Canterbury doing Cinderella this year. Um, have you done sort of panto before? I have never done pantomime before, but I know people most commonly know me now as being a Christian from EastEnders, but before that uh, I did a lot of musical theatre. So I'm very excited to be doing my first musical production since 2007. Uh, so it's great to get back on stage and flex my musical theatre muscles as opposed to uh, the other guns that people are used to seeing me flex <laughs> these days. about this actual pantomime on Cinderella a lot of people say it's it's, it's one of the better ones with the story and the characters and, and stuff. I mean it's beautiful obviously I first came to Cinderella through the ballet really and uh, so, so uh, it's a classic fairy tale um, I feel really honored to be part of this production we are aiming to make this production one of the biggest and the best that Canterbury have seen to go with the fantastic new theatre that you have here I mean I think it's fantastic that Canterbury this old town with all these beautiful old architecture has now got a 21st century theatre in which uh, all productions, big productions can come here you know, and be a part of. I think it's really nice to see that blend of uh, old architecture with modern architecture. So we're just really looking forward to putting in a 21st century pantomime into this, uh, this theatre. Uh, Michael, I'd say it's a bit of a homecoming for you because you yes. come yeah. from Canterbury originally. Really excited. Um, I was born in Canterbury, uh, I lived here for years, uh, my family are from here. Uh, my mum was a hairdresser in Canterbury for years, uh, my dad was born in Winchie, uh, my granddad was born in North Lane. 
Um, I started my first professional performance was as a lost boy in Peter Pan at the Old Marlow, mm -hmm. uh, and I was in the Marlow Youth Theatre as a kid. Um, so the fact that I'm coming back uh, to my hometown in the new venue, and I'm going to be the first pantomime dame on the stage, me and Ian, and so it's a really big thrill for me. Oh, marvelous! Well, until Christmas, Canterbury.